and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very special video for me because I'm not the biggest fan of fish. Today we're gonna be making two different recipes with cod. You don't need a lot of ingredients to make them, so one of them is gonna be kind of a pate and the other one is gonna be baked in the oven. And I would say that they can be done in about 15 minutes each, so it's a good and quick option to eat fish. Let's get started. Oh my god, it smells disgusting, I don't like fish, why am I doing this? I mean, I hate the smell, but then when they're cooked, it's not that bad. I mean, I love salmon and the smell, I can't still. So we need four cloves of garlic in total. Two of them are gonna be boiled and two of them are gonna be fried. So we're gonna put our fish in hot water with two cloves of garlic and also some bay leaves. It doesn't even need to boil. So once you see the foam coming to the top, it's because it's ready and we can take it out. I'm gonna put the oil with the other two cloves of garlic. And again, this doesn't need to boil. Once you see the bubbles around the garlic, it's because you can take them out. You can leave it one or two minutes apart before taking the garlic out. I'm gonna put the same oil where I fried the garlic in a small pot. And now we're gonna remove the skin. So yeah, make sure you're not putting bones in. See, it already smells better. And now remove the skin of the garlic and this one is boiled and then the fried ones too. Now I'm gonna put a little bit of pepper. My hands are just full of oil now. So if you're putting a, an entire piece, you should put one cup of oil. I broke the only container where I could blend stuff, so now it's a nightmare. Now that I have the paste, I'm gonna add a little bit of cream. As always, I'm using oat cream. Now it's the moment to add salt and pepper. So if you eat cheese, you can now put some cheese on top and put it in the oven for five minutes with the heat on top and it's delicious. And you also, I mean, I would usually eat it with toast. It might not be the best way to eat fish, but it's delicious and at least you eat fish. So try it out. For the baked one, we're just gonna put our fish. I'm gonna put some pepper. We're gonna need some homemade mayonnaise. So we're gonna put a little bit of garlic, one egg and a little bit of oil. And we're gonna start blending it while we add more oil. And also salt and pepper. Mine is not amazing. You can see it's quite liquid, but I'm gonna use it anyway. I didn't want to do just the fish because that's not a lot. I just boiled some small potatoes and now I'm gonna smash them. Okay, so you need to do it gently because you don't wanna break them a lot. Just a little bit so they get smashed. We're gonna use the mayo, but I also wanna use a little bit of a garlic butter topping. So I'm gonna melt two tablespoons of soy butter with some chopped garlic, and we're just gonna have it in the heat for two minutes. So I'm gonna put the butter on the smashed potatoes with some of the garlic on top. How do I do that now? We're gonna eat a lot of pepper. Yay. So the worst part of what just happened is that it's the second time that it happens. And now we're gonna put our mayo on our fish. So now we're going to the oven. I'm gonna leave it for about eight minutes, 200, and then I'm gonna put it for Four minutes more with the heating on top, so it gets kind of crunchy. 
and it's ready. So we have this one here and this pate is also ready. I am ready. I'm gonna try it because I said I didn't like fish. The me. ultimate test. Yes. I mean, I'm not the biggest fan of fish anyway, but... I let us know. It's good. Because the taste of the fish is smooth. It's not super strong. I like that. Oh, the sauce, like the, the mayonnaise. It's super good. It's super good, seriously. I'm impressed. I wasn't sure if I would like it because I've tried to eat this kind of fish before and I don't really like the texture, but it's super smooth and salty with the sauce. Impressed, approved. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it again, yeah. So that's it for today's video. I hope you like it. As I said, they're super easy to do and it literally takes 15 minutes each. So I hope you try them out. If you do, tell me if you like them and see you in the next one. What you, you want attention? Yes. <laughs> okay, let's take some photos.